Manyiwa. Introduction. There she is, Sam, in all her healthy glory. Doesn't smell like glory to me. <laughs> so is organic manure anything from plant or animal remains? Yes. And they are waste as well. Manure is defined as organic substances added to soil to provide one or more plant nutrients. The manure derived from plants and animal remains supply soil component known as organic matter. Well done, Sam. The organic matter decomposes to become humus. During decomposition, nutrients are released to the soil. Ah, humus, my friend. Mm -hmm. This is the part of soil that greatly helps improve it by providing needed nutrients depending on what it is decomposed from. You seem to have a pretty good grasp on this subject. Humus form part of the soil colloids which greatly influences soil chemical properties. What are soil colloids? Soil colloids are the tiniest of soil particles with less than 0.001 millimeters in diameter. Wow. Soil colloids are the most active portion of the soil and determine the physical and chemical properties of a soil. Most soils contain 2 to 10 percent of organic matter. Did you know that? No, doctor. Now you do. However, even in small amounts, organic matter is very important. Care to discuss why organic matter is very important in soil? I thought you had some knowledge in this subject. Where do I start? First, it provides food and a home for soil microorganisms such as bacteria, fungi, and worms. Mm -hmm. These microorganisms return the favor by decomposing the organic matter into humus. Correct. Keep going. Secondly, organic matter is a reservoir of nutrients that can be released to the soil. Mm -hmm. Organic residues supply not only readily available nutrients, but also the building blocks of humus. Uh-huh. And humus is the product that is left over after decomposition has ended. And it is extremely important in increasing and maintaining soil fertility. Think of humus as a bank which holds nutrients and can release them in response to plants, or microorganism needs. Also, humus being mostly dark in color, it absorbs heat to keep the soil warm. Thanks for your help. Moving on, mm -hmm. organic matter in the soil increases the water holding capacity. Yes. Organic matter behaves somehow like a sponge with the ability to absorb and hold up to 90% of its weight in water. Excellent. A great advantage of the water holding capacity of organic matter is that the matter will release most of the water that it absorbs to plants. Mm -hmm. In contrast, clay holds great quantities of water, but much of it is unavailable to plants. Organic matter, or rather humus to be exact, mm -hmm causes soil to clump and form soil aggregates, which improves soil structure. Yes. With better soil structure, permeability, also known as infiltration of water through the soil, mm -hmm. improves. In turn, this improves the soil ability to take up and hold water. Correct. Aeration of the soil is also improved in the process. Wow. Soil organic matter also buffers soil pH, mm -hmm. meaning it moderates the effect of soil pH on soils by avoiding rapid chemical changes caused by addition of acidic fertilizers and liming materials. Mm -hmm. In addition, yes. it reduces the toxicity of plant poisons that may have built up in the soil as a result of continuous use of agrochemicals such as pesticides and fungicides. Very well. So in summary, mm -hmm. 
organic matter increases water holding capacity yes increases infiltration rate correct supplies nutrients mm -hmm. provides food and home for microorganisms mm -hmm. improves soil structure and buffers soil ph all right i was worried you are going to name everything and leave nothing for me organic matter also reduces toxicity of plant poisons in the soil and the dark humors help balance the temperature of the soil oh i did know those i don't doubt it now while i do love organic manure do you know their disadvantages well mze and i talked about it very briefly discussing organic farming okay something about bulkiness yes a lot of manure is needed since they have low nutritive value per unit volume and this takes up a lot of space since it is bulky mm -hmm. it takes a lot of work to transport and apply it hey farming builds muscles and character right yep and if stored poorly manure will lose its nutrients exactly anyway manures can spread diseases pests and weeds and if it is used when not fully decomposed the crops do not benefit from it at all so manures can be in different forms and shapes mm -hmm. does each type have a specific name yes and i can go over them in detail if you come with me okay